Hello and welcome to the History of Transformers. Today's episode, The History of Hound, from the Generation 1 cartoon continuity. And here we go. Hound wishes he were human. The dark, barren metal scapes of Cybertron no longer interest him. Now that Hound has been shipwrecked on Earth, he considers this planet his home. He sees mankind as beautiful and wishes he could interact with their ecosphere the same way they do, to feel what they feel and to see what they see. He treasures his job as an Autobot scout, making good use of his ability to project holograms for added disguise. He uses this opportunity to explore the breathtaking caverns and mountainous expanses that Earth provides. Hound was one of the original Autobots aboard the Ark when it crashed on Earth four million years ago. When awakened in 1984, he was reformatted to have a terrestrial alt mode, that of a Mitsubishi military jeep. As the Autobots got their bearings on this strange new planet, Optimus Prime dispatched Hound on a recon mission to find the Decepticons. Cliff Jumper tagged along uninvited, itching to start a fight, and took a pot shot at Megatron. Once Hound sniffed out the Decepticon base, Cliff Jumper missed, and the Decepticons gave chase. Laserbeak pursued the two Autobot eavesdroppers, and Hound took the brunt of the assault, getting blasted by Laserbeak's cannons. Hound spun out of control on the winding mountain roads and crashed into a ravine. Cliffjumper returned with help, the Autobot medic Ratchet. Hound was too injured even to transform, so the crane truck hauler had to lift him out of the gulch so he could be dragged back to the Ark for repair. Despite the mishap, Hound bore no ill will against Cliffjumper. The scout had a hard enough time about Megatron's plans to plunder Earth's resources that Optimus immediately launched a mission to stop the Decepticons. Later, when the Autobots counterattacked the Decepticon siege of Sherman Dam, Hound got into an underwater fight with Rumble. The pint-sized Decepticon managed to trap Hound under a pile of boulders so that he couldn't move. Then Spike Witwicky jumped in and removed the boulders, thus saving Hound from drowning. After they came back from the ruby mines of Burma, Hound and Mirage came up with a plan to fool the Decepticons. They would create a hologram of the rocket fuel base. The Decepticons would go there to use the resources to create energon cubes, at which point the trap could be sprung. Optimus Prime agreed, and the then imprisoned Ravage was allowed to escape with false information. However, Megatron outsmarted the Autobots, went to the real rocket fuel base, and used its resources. In the year 2005, Hound was stationed at Autobot City on Earth. Shortly after the Decepticon attack, Hound was part of Cup's detail, placing a roadblock on the trail to Lookout Mountain. During the battle, he managed to get to the shuttle landing pad as Optimus Prime began his counterattack on the Decepticon forces. 